for tuning in so today I'm just gonna be talking about why followers don't matter and I know a lot of people don't want to hear this but it's important I think that it's important to know your goals as a business owner and it's important to have longevity so it's easy to get caught into the um, ego aspect of wanting to have a lot of followers and be popular but if you do what you're supposed to do the followers will come the money will come and you will have longevity in a growing business so I'm gonna be talking about three reasons why followers don't matter number one if you cannot make money with a thousand followers you cannot make money with a hundred thousand followers and I think people have the idea that once they reach a certain point of followers and that's when all the money's going to start rolling in everybody's just going to be throwing their money at them that's going to you know increase their law of averages which is somewhat true yeah your business will pick up but if you can master making money at a thousand followers then you're going to be booming at a hundred thousand or booming at ten thousand or even at five thousand so how do you make money at a thousand followers well, <laughs> um, you have to have systems in place behind the scenes. You have to have a quality products or services. You have to have a sales funnel to get people from your social media page and into your bank account. Um, what's the sales funnel that they follow? Um, are you consistent? There's so many things that go into it. You have to have your systems um, down packed. And I think a lot of people think, oh, I have a business. I'm just going to get on social media. I'm going to tell everybody that I have these services and products and everybody's going to buy. And I know for a fact, I've talked to lots of entrepreneurs that, and I know for a fact that that does not work. <laughs> people need to be sold on you. People need to be sold on your product. People need to know that you're credible. People need to know that you have great customer service. Like all these things go into play, come into play when you're selling things online and via social media. People aren't just going to buy with buy from you because you have a product or a service because there's thousands of people who have that same product or service. Um, you need to have systems in place at a thousand followers. Not when you get to 10,000, not when you reach these other goals. You have to put in the work where you are and then you'll continue to grow. So that's my number one. If you can't make money at a thousand followers, you're not going to make money at a hundred thousand followers. You might make money, but you're not going to make the money that you should be making or that you'll probably expect to make. My number two is engagement trumps all. Engagement, engagement, engagement. I know you're probably sick of hearing it, but it's important because that is what's going to convert to sales. If you have 10,000 followers and you're only getting 100 likes on your pictures or your, or your images, or um, you're not getting anybody commenting or anybody interacting with you, then it doesn't matter. You know, honestly, people can buy fake followers nowadays. You can buy 100,000 followers, I think, for like $99 or something like that. Um, so what you need to be looking at is your engagement because that is what is going to convert. And a rule of thumb is to always have 10% of your audience engaging. So if you have 1,000 followers, then you should be getting around 100 likes. Um, and just kind of go from there to see how many people are actually interacting with you. Because if you're posting things that aren't getting any interaction, then it doesn't matter how many followers you have because they're not looking at it or they don't care about what you're talking about. Um, so that is extremely important. I see so many accounts with all these followers or especially with the new algorithm. And I'm speaking about Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, whatever. Um, the reason for Instagram changing the algorithm is so that you have to actually be social. Um, I feel like there was a huge trend of like very bloggerish, stylish images, coffee cups and laptops and all these style shoots and stock photos. And I mean, honestly, they're a dime a dozen. Like everybody's page looks good. Everybody's page looks styled. Everybody's page looks beautiful because you can get a stock photo from a zillion websites out there, you know? Um, so Instagram was like, okay, like nobody cares about this anymore. 
so the key <laughs> is to make sure that you are posting quality images quality content that people actually want to engage with and people actually get to know you and your brand and who you are and what you stand for um so that's most important so number two engagement trumps followers number three quality over quantity and i know people say that all the time it's an oldie but goodie like it'll always trump all you want to have a quality audience you want to have your target market you don't want just random people following you and i think a lot of people will just do anything for followers they don't care who it is <laughs> like that's the crazy thing that's the scary thing about you know people buying followers or these hashtags or these like for likes like they literally just want anybody to follow them so they can have a high follower account it's so ridiculous <laughs> like i don't really know what else to say it's ridiculous um you want to make sure that you have a quality audience because those are the people who are going to stand by you for years buy your products for years support you forever because they're, they're your target market i think the whole point of business is to grow and have longevity i think that's the whole point so when people focus on um vanity numbers like the amount of followers they have or or trying all these different tricks to get followers or following every trend that comes out i think that that is very um can be very detrimental to your brand so i hope this helps someone i hope it made sense <laughs> i think it's extremely important to look like i said to look at the bigger picture and not so much of followers i mean followers are important but if you do what you're supposed to do if you have your systems in place if you're putting out quality content if you're interacting with your target market you will grow and most importantly they will convert to sales which is the most important thing so i hope this helped someone if you have any questions make sure to comment below if you haven't already subscribed to my channel please subscribe. I'm going to be posting videos like this weekly talking about social media and entrepreneurship. So if you have any questions on anything that, anything that you would like to see, um, please leave them below and make sure to connect with me on all my social media sites. I'm going to leave that below too. Bye.